Have you ever wondered how the mobile network handles extreme traffic? Such as in a stadium packed with people? And how does this impact electromagnetic field levels? To answer this, researchers conducted a groundbreaking study during the 2023 Australian Football League Grand Final at the Melbourne Cricket Ground, with 100,000 people in attendance. The stadium has nine mid-band 5G base stations located around it. The researchers monitored these, tracking how the network managed tens of thousands of users sharing photos and videos of the action in real time. The results? Even with all that activity, the actual power levels emitted by these base stations were far lower than you might expect. On average, the power contributing to RF exposure was just 7.6% of the maximum. Even at its peak, it reached only 10.4%. This is thanks to advanced 5G technologies like Massive Multiple Input Multiple Output, also referred to as Massive MIMO which incorporate many antenna elements within the base station and uses beam steering to direct the signal to each device when they need it. Beam steering maximizes the data rate for the user and uses only a fraction of the total output power, lowering the overall EMF exposure. So, even in extreme usage conditions like a stadium full of people using their mobile devices, 5G remains efficient and operates well within international exposure limits. By grounding their work in real-world data, these researchers are paving the way for accurate assessments of 5G networks, demonstrating that they're not just fast, but also operate well within international RF limits, even when operating with extreme traffic.